I am on a review Loki today, so the series is over with. Series uh, episode six came out today, and let's just say, crap, I'm gonna uh, spoil it. All right, give it. Uh, let me get move, 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 move. Okay, I'm so sorry for that. Whew. Hope you didn't see that. I'm really sorry. I didn't know that that was revealed in the bottom. So I'm gonna try to censor that bit out, okay? But um, so back at that my back to Loki. So this is like a variant thing. He started his job in the TVA after the events from Avengers 2012 when he got snapped away from that cube Tesseract and um, he went on to go to the TVA to work for this variant thing with different time stuff and stuff there's three four or five Lokis you got the old Loki the out oh, even the alligator there's an, there's even an alligator Loki yeah this was really cool how they did the time stuff. It's setting up all these parallel universes. But it wasn't as good as Falcon and the Winter Soldier. I mean, Falcon and the Winter Soldier was a really good one. So this one's about an 8 out of 10. Um, so this might be setting up for uh, a lot of things. Uh, if you don't know about the Alter Universe, you're going to have a lot of stuff that highlights the Alter Universes. Loki was really good with all these variants, and I think Tom Hiddleston did a good job playing Loki again. Um, the one girl variant was pretty cool. This girl right here, she's pretty cool. Um, you had the, you had the, it beat WandaVision, and it didn't beat, it didn't beat as far as a Falcon Winter Soldier, but I think Loki is second best of the Marvel stuff so far. Stay tuned for more Marvel reviews, and this has been Austin Miller, a.k.a. Silver Bell signing out.